Hello everyone, today we're going to be talking about this 2020 wide body Mustang. Uh, this is a car that I've been building for some time. I finally got it done. Uh, there's really not uh, mechanical issues with this car. This car has a long story, but basically right now it's, it's done. However, I'm having an issue. There's a couple things I don't like. Uh, so we did the body kit on this car and we had to use these uh, bolts to attach the kit into the body, but I hate it. So I really want to try to use blend it in and delete uh, the bolts. So when you do that, you have to obviously do body work to mold it in. And then I'm going to have to paint it. I'm going to have to repaint. Uh, and I think that because of that, I want to change the color of the car. Uh, so I've, you know, I've been having to go back and try to find a color that I'm going to love. But basically, that's what I'm doing. And the reason I'm doing this is just basically I want to delete these uh, bolts. But there's something else going on with the fiber of this uh, kit. And, okay, I don't think uh, you can see it here. I'm going to try to zoom in. It's going to be really hard to see. But basically, for some reason, I'm able to see the, the fibers right here on the, on the body kit. I can see the fibers. Even though we did a prime and we also did a, a sealer before we painted it. But anyway, there's quite a bit of stuff that you cannot see here. You might not be able to see here, uh, but there's quite a bit of fibers and I do not like that. I, I want my car to be like completely finished and don't have all those little blams. But I, I think this is gonna be an opportunity for me to be able to work on the car, uh, do some changes that I want and probably do a change of color. Uh, so let me know what you think. I'm gonna be uh, changing the color on the car. I'm gonna be working on that. And after that, that will be the very last thing. Pretty much since I got the car, I went from an idea and I don't want to make the video too long, but basically the way that uh, everything started, it's uh, I bought this car for parts. I bought this car so that I could build my 56 F100 right here. That's the reason I bought it. I wanted to pull the drivetrain out of this. I found this car in Georgia. Uh, the company who was supposed to bring it to me, I paid them up front. That's the way you do it. Uh, but they never brought it. It was probably about a month waiting and they never picked it up. So one day I just decided to fly out there, rent a U-Haul, a trailer, and bring it all the way back. And um, I had to drive for about 14 hours from where I picked it up in Georgia to Houston, Texas. And uh, once I got it back in the shop, I walked around the car and uh, I decided to um the car was actually in pretty good condition i mean it, it, it had damage but it wasn't really all that bad and i i figure i decided to repair the car and that's the reason i end up you know having another convertible but anyway uh so i started working on it once i actually work on the car i decided oh i'm gonna make it special i'm gonna get a wide body put the wide body once we got the wide body then i found out that you need to have custom made wheels for this car which is not cheap and i went ahead and ordered a set of wheels we finally got them but as some of you know whenever you're working on cars it's just a never-ending story there's always something else and uh, so right now i'm having to deal with this uh, situation where i want to delete the bolts from the body kit and because of that i'm gonna change the color um but it's just been quite a bit of a uh, things to do on this car but the car doesn't have any problems at all no check engine light everything's good with the car there's no issues at all uh, but since I'm gonna be working on this I think uh, I'm gonna be changing the color uh, I want to just have a different look and hopefully everything will go smooth uh, and uh, so stay tuned I wanted to do this video I wanted to share what's going on give you an update on what's going on with this car but hopefully it's gonna come out looking great uh, I'm excited to see what the new color is going to do to the car. I started taking it apart right here. You can see one of the parts. And uh, I'm going to start working on it, guys. So stay tuned.